Twitch for the first time since August. A whole month off on YouTube, and then Twitch finally added. The shit I was waiting for. Um, so they added a lot more ability to help clean things up. Um, but again, this is my first stream on Twitch in a, over a month, so if there's a sound issue, let me know. If there's, I don't know, if there's any issues. I think my desktop audio is not working. Hold on. Maybe something. rather make sure everything is like good before we jump into the actual game. I'm getting a little sweaty because I'm a little frightened, but I am wearing my heart monitor. I did promise. I am wearing a heart monitor. Um, I can feel my heart rate is higher than usual already because I'm terrified. Um, I know what's coming. Like the tutorial is scary. Like everything about this game is too much for me. Um, yeah, I'm a little bit stressed. Uh, is it better? So yelling, like I'm talking really loud. I definitely want to make sure this balances out beforehand. And we all know I'm going to hurt everyone using earbuds is going to get hurt at some point today. Because I know I'm going to scream. I really need that Elgato Wave because it has like that scream peak protection. It's better. It's good or it's just better? Because I want it to be good. I want to make sure everyone can hear me. Um... One, switching back to Twitch, and then two, starting a new game. I have to change the settings every time. It's a pain in the ass, but I'd rather do it now than when we're playing. Um, this game does, I think this game does have a pause, but it doesn't have a HUD, which is terrifying. Um, you have to listen to voices to figure out where to go. I probably shouldn't be wearing these. I should probably be wearing my actual headphones. Um... But fuck it, we're just gonna we're just gonna do this. I might switch to my headphones um, next time. We'll see. Um, but yeah, so game time. There's my heart rate. If I don't know if anyone remembers, but when we played Little Nightmares, my average heart rate is between 80 and 85. So it's already a little bit elevated. Um, I am really nervous. 
this game. Like I said, I've played this game before. It came out, I want to say, in like 2015, 2016, around that time. And it was a digital-only release. They never made physical copies. I bought it on PS4. I played through maybe what I'm assuming is a third of it, but it might not actually be that much. Um, so I'm assuming I played through a third of it. But it scared me so badly that I turned it off and never looked back until now. And now we're going to play it. Um, I figured because there's no HUD, I didn't need to shrink the screen down to make sure you guys can see like 95% of everything. So I'm just going to take up this little box. It should be okay. If it ends up being in too much of the way, I'll, I'll move somewhere else on the screen. Um, but yeah, there's no HUD on this game at all. So there's no like stats anywhere. There's no life. There's nothing. Um, you have... It's assumed that Senua... This is Senua here. It's assumed she's like cursed. Um, from what I gather, she has some kind of like schizophrenia possibly. Like it's hinted towards that kind of what it is. Um, but she hears voices in her head, and they direct her where to go. <laughs> and they are panicked, creepy voices. So, <laughs> I'm good. Well, mm, I was good until today, until right now, where now I have, now I have to play this game, and I'm scared. <laughs> the longer I talk, the longer I don't have to play the game. Let's just keep talking casual. <laughs> um, I'm good. I'm on vacation this whole week, so... Just hanging out. Oh. I cleaned my kitchen. I got groceries. The guy who delivered my groceries was having a bad day. I bought a pack of like water bottles, like just like a 24 pack of these. And I would he texted me and said, like, I'm at your house. So I went to the front door. I live in an apartment. So I went to the front door so I could like get my groceries from him. And I get there and I see he's like parked across the street, but like right in front of my house. And he pulls out the case of water with so much force. Like, I feel like he didn't remember how heavy it was. And he pulls it out with so much force that the, the thing, it's a plastic bag, but like the thick plastic, it ripped in half. And the half that he was holding just went all over the street up it like water bottles just exploded everywhere and then the other half just fell to the floor like it ripped in half one half of the water bottles went <clears throat> and the other other half just like plopped on the floor and then he looked at the house and i'm like sitting in the doorway and he's like shit she definitely saw that happen and then he's like crawling all over the middle of the street to put the water bottles in like a shopping bag to bring me the rest of the water bottles that exploded everywhere and he was like i'm so sorry and i'm like it's it's fine like it's just stop just give me my stuff and go <laughs> like you're having a bad day just stop it's fine it's fine just go just go please <laughs> um so that was entertaining and then facebook was down and i mean who cares so whatever um so yeah today's fine it was pretty chill because i didn't have to do work um i played sims 4 i had to reboot on friday i had to completely reset my computer from scratch and i backed up everything except some of my game files so i lost all of my sims 4 houses that i had created which is very rude um so I started a new one yesterday, <sighs> and I made a little more headway today, but it's on the uh, island living portion, so it's like a tropical island. Um, the second, the back half of the house is over the water, it's like built on stilts, so it's pretty cool, I'm nowhere near done, um, just the walls are built, and now I'm starting to decorate the outside before I do the inside. Um, but yeah, I lost so much, so many hours of Sims 4. Hard work. I did so much hard work. Um, I'll get back to it one day. But I was like, I'm just gonna start something new. I don't want to have to rebuild anything from scratch again. I did have to rebuild my character, but now she looks more like me, so I guess that's good. Um, 
I think we're gonna do it. We're gonna. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'm gonna hit start. I'm so scared. <laughs> I'm so scared. Okay, I'm sweating. I'm so nervous. load screen is stressing me out too <sighs> good luck i'm gonna need it boy yo am i scared i'm pretty sure i turned the subtitles on who are you or i didn't i don't keep see them i'm trying to oh god i hate the sound you're safe with me i'll be right here nice and close i can speak with the others. God. Even in the earbuds. I'm out. Even in the earbuds, I only hear it like the voice is whispering in this ear. That's not Senua talking. That's one of her voices. Um, I can only hear it in this ear, but it started in this ear. Like I, I felt it like ugh, wrap around. I don't like it. But I am subtitles. I definitely turned these on. Accessibility. Um, okay. Your whole story has already come to an end, but now it begins anew. What's happening? It's real, it's creepy. It's brutal, but it's creepy. I don't like it. Deep into darkness. There will be no more stories after this one. Well, that's a lie. There's a sequel coming out probably next year. <laughs> they announced it earlier this year. Oh, how rude of me. You played this? It's really good. It's just really scary. I bought this so long ago to on PC That's to like replay and I was like, nah. Some are old. Halloween Some calls. Changed. I think the darkness changed them just like it changed her. Can you see anyone? We know how I feel about hanging bodies. This, the bo I don't know if you guys saw, there was a body on the spike. That doesn't bother me. The hanging body bothers me. It is real after all. I don't know why. She's finally um, arrived in the land of mist and fog. Always have. They, they bother me a lot. Place the Northmen call hell. When the voices say go back, go back, go back, it's not safe, then you go back. Because it's clearly not safe. There are dead bodies everywhere. Mabel. They're everywhere. I listen to my inside voices. No, Mabel, come back. I need your emotional therapy. Like they mom, you're being weird. In the fields and rivers of hell. So many bodies on but spikes. They don't always lie still here. This is not a place of rest. So, the actress that did the mocap for Senua also did. Uh, she's also the face model. She did all the mocap, and she just worked for Ninja Theory. Like they just picked her and was like, "This should be you." Um, you feel that watching? So now she's like an actress. And <laughs> the way they announced the sequel to this game was everyone thought it was like a cinematic for the movie. It is a live action taping of the woman. Who is her voice actress and mocap and thinking? face model? Like, it is just her acting, and I'm like, that's incredible.
Jesus Christ. It looks so good. When we finish this game, we can watch that together. I think she would get used to it by now. I'm just so yes. The darkness. It just builds onto itself, growing stronger, towering over her. He might try and ignore it. Turn away. Also, the game in Slaves that I played Why you're most vulnerable. in like August? is made by Ninja Theory it's as like well. It knows that it just they went from it. that like 10 years ago to it's this. Really need to see its suffocating power. And actually that was like maybe a five year span between those two games and this is what came out. So they've made vast improvements in a short period of time. The sequel is going to be ridiculous looking. Yeah, they announced the sequel to this game earlier this year. Justin, thank you for that host. They announced it earlier this year. Um, it is a phenomenal looking commercial. It's just her yelling and like freaking out in a close up. Um, and it's great. <laughs> because it's not, everyone thought it was CGI and I was like, no, that's the actual like woman, that's her. <laughs> it's not, it's not the computer. Benua. It's like the actual woman. It's a video. Um, and she's in the full face paint. She's got like runes painted all over her. It's terrifying. It looks so terrifying. Um, okay, so she is floating to this island. That little pouch she's got on her head is her dead lover's head. Uh, Dillian. That, that's him. Yeah, she could be that. Very, uh, Juliet Starling, a la Lollipop Chainsaw. <laughs> but, you know, without the laugh. I thinking. I hear her thoughts. It's not too late to get into the boat and go back. No one will judge you. No one will ever know. It is. It's me back on Twitch. Oh, she heard us. No going she back. thinks I'm her voice. I'm not, girl. I don't want you to go. Wait, maybe I am your voice. Oh, girl, no. I'm the one that's telling you to go back. And now pushes away a world that was <gasps> Yeah, this game is like pretty, but also pretty disgusting and also pretty There's nothing scary. to go back to and worse to look forward to. Like 90% of the- all the enemies you, you fight are like maybe hallucinations. Like there's literally the nothing that you're fighting. Um but she is not mentally well. Okay, so we are here, we are Senua. With our, our man on our hip. Let's chainsaw some zombies. Look really clearly. Focus, Senua, focus. Focus and you'll see. They don't tell Things you how to do focus. anything. And like I said, there's no HUD. Forget my story, Senua. There's no lifeline, nothing comes from hell. Yeah, they just figure it out. Press buttons there. and figure it out. They say the burning of a corpse will take you straight to hell as good. But gods and the living will follow this path. You must leave the Isles of Orkney across the eastern sea and find a road that leads north and down through deep, dark valleys. Wait, how did you sub? After nine nights of riding, you will I'm not an affiliate river. anymore. And will find a bridge covered in gold. How did that happen? The path to Helheim goes from there, across the river of knives that how flows that into the dark world of Niflheim. Thank you, but how did that happen? Wait, I'm so confused. Did the six month thing before you left? By six months. Oh, oh, like a solid six months. That's so weird, because I even, I turned off my affiliate. Like, I put in an, a request. I thought they were going to refund everyone for that. Oh, you prepaid. That makes sense. I probably got that payout already then. Um, okay, so if you haven't guessed by the reference to Helheim and all of that stuff. This follows um, North Mytho Norse mythology and um, all that stuff. Um, yeah. Am I 
not done? Is there Do more? Do not forget my story, Senua. Because your darkness this is her man comes talking from hell, to her. And your fate lies there. They say the burning of a corpse will take you straight to hell. It is north, yes. <laughs> the gods and the living. Yeah, see, they reference one. Hela. You must leave the Isles of Orkney across the Eastern Sea and find a road that leads north and down through deep, dark valleys. After nine nights of riding, you will My Norse mythology river. literally comes from Marvel Comics, God gold. of War, the um... Goes from there. Assassin's Creed Valhalla and like this knives, game. Like that is it. That's what I know of Norse mythology. God of War is probably uh, the most filled with information. <laughs> they also did confirm that in the sequel that um, you'll be able to go to all nine realms, which is exciting. She, okay, she like just kept looking at that. It freaked me out. Alright, I am not pleased. Okay, she just automatically went over that. Cool. As long as you know L Loki turned into a mare and had a baby. I'm oh, I don't like being in the water. Um, I mean, I know a decent amount of Loki also from God of War. Like, Marvel taught me, honestly, very little. Because most of Marvel, they literally stole Norse mythology and then, like, didn't do things correctly. They're like, and then also, we'll fuck up your religion. Um, God of War... Like, they did their homework. So, I do know about Loki and the World Serpent, and he can speak to snakes, and um, his son is a, a wolf. Um, I can't think of his name. Why can't I think of his name? I want to say Fenrir. Is that correct, or is that the centaur from Harry Potter? Or both? It is Fenrir, okay. It's also the centaur from Harry Potter is Fenrir. Okay, it's both. It's both. <laughs> I was like, wait. Um, yeah, so I know that, like, Loki's son is a wolf. Um, I know that Loki is an ice giant, and he was stolen from by Odin. I know all that shit. At home relaxing, watching 700,000 things and somehow understanding them all. You're insane. I don't know how you function. This is getting so loud and I don't like it. Mm, it's the voices for me. It's the voices for me. Fenrir was the evil werewolf that followed Baldi Butt, wasn't he? No, in, in Harry Potter, Fenrir was the centaur. Um, and centaurs just in general don't like humans or magic folk. Um, and Fenrir is also the one in the movie, but I feel like it happened differently in the book, it's been a while. In the movie, he's the one that sees Voldemort, um, kill a unicorn for its blood because it has healing powers. Okay, see, the voice is telling me to run when I don't have the ability to do that. That's really not me up. Darkness is coming. Like, why isn't she running? I'm like, damn bitch, because I can't. Hunger. Like a pack of wolves in a hunt. But she's not stopping. Mm. Oh, maybe that that's what I was thinking. They're close, they're close. Google's on rescue. Always. There's nothing worse than when you're like, oh, what's that thing? And then you don't Google it, even if it's something dumb and not important. Like, you have to Google it. Otherwise, you never stop thinking about it. Oh, I don't like that. Okay. Honestly, horror in the sunlight is, is much better for me. Mabel, I'm glad you're back, because... Mommy is stressed. JK Turkling <laughs> reused the thing. Place they call it's possible. Helheim. I mean, she took that very authentic Chinese name, Cho Chang. The sheer racism of that woman, I literally can't. 
I just want to say, I've never loved anyone enough to be like, after you die, I'm gonna, like, tie your head to my waist. I hear you. This must be soulmate stuff, because I don't, I don't fuck with this. That's pretty gross in my opinion. The source of the darkness is in hell. At least in Lollipop Chainsaw, he could, like, talk back to her like he was hanging out. Her dear beloved. Dear Leanne. Okay, honestly, in my head, I'm just gonna pretend this is, like, the goth Lollipop Chainsaw. Where Lollipop Chainsaw is, like, the cheerleader version of this. To carry your boyfriend's head on your hip. Although in God of War they did that too. Hmm. So yeah, um, her soulmate died, and his soul is in Helheim, and she's gonna go there and get it back. I don't think it's worth it, but we have different values, clearly. She'll never know the bridge to Helheim. She forgets too. But she does remember that only the dead may cross it. That part wasn't so easy to forget. I don't know why, but that hole with the red ribbon sounds like where I need to go. Let's see, shall we? I do remember I fight people, like hallucination type people, but I don't remember if I get a weapon to do that or if I am just unarmed fighting people. Oh, save. Save icon. I feel like we will find out soon. Was this? Read me the runes, boy. The, world. the world of men I call Midgard. The sky gods dwell in Asgard. I know this information. Earth, harvest, wind, and sea dwell in Vanaheim. The good elves dwell in Alfheim. The evil ones dwell in Svartalfheim. The mountain giants dwell in Jotunheim. Jotunheim is where Loki is from. See, Muspelheim. I do know some stuff. Niflheim is the world of ice and darkness. Only the dead dwell in Helheim, and that is where you must travel. So I guess my question is, because in order, f when you die, in order to go to Valhalla, you need to die with your, like, weapon in hand. That's like the mythology. So because he's in Helheim, I love that they don't tell you what buttons to press. They're like, press them all until you know. But thankfully the controls are pretty intuitive, so that's nice. There is no running though, that, that I can figure out at least. Oh, I have a sword. Okay, I missed that part. She keeps saying I don't know where I'm going, and she makes me want to die. Stop. Just drop down. What's down there? Okay, A is to climb, A is to drop down. That's A, right? Yeah. She shouldn't have done it. PC controller. Still not used to the the buttons. I still think everything is PlayStation. It's dangerous, touch it. Don't like when you me. eat something that's gross, you're like, it's gross, try it. 
I was just hiding. You can't go back to your boat. You kicked it longer, into the middle of the goddamn river. Please, please let the bastard touch me again. Never! Please. Who are you? You're just a member, Drew. Truth. A liar and old fool. Truth is my truth. Truth is my truth. Hashtag truth is my truth. It's good to see you again. You kept your vow. Guide me through this life and the next. I will tell you my stories of hell. If I may walk. It sounds like a bad voice to have. Tell me your stories again, old friend. I'm listening. The runes seal the gates to hell. Focus your inner eye. And you too will see. Focus your inner what's eye. In sight. My inner eyes. Your eyes. Oh. I can the see same thing I've been using to focus. Find one like it to open the gate. Okay, we have to find that symbol somewhere else to focus on. I just saw it. I don't know why I thought that was maybe it. Oh, I see it. Shadows in the trees. Look towards the gate. And the gate will open. Go through it. It's dangerous. Oh, I don't like that I can hear some of the voices in this ear and some of them in this ear. They really feel like they're in my head. It's very uncomfortable. It's so weird. But what's behind the gate? Where will it take you? It's not safe. It worked. Okay. Climbing up, jumping down, and opening things is all the same button. I spent six years enslaved in hell. Suddenly raining. But I watched the night. We had two seconds of sunshine, that's enough. You, you listen? When everyone else laughed. My people blow a heavy price. Carry my stories with you. And together we will make the Northmen feel our fury. Okay, honestly, oh god. I'm terrified of heights. This is stressful. Um I don't like it. The Another voice joins us. The um to Weather elements are fantastic in this game. They weren't real. It looks what so good. That? I am a sucker for good weather elements. Okay, this bridge is in disrepair. Fuck. We could stand on the edge. You can just death go, right? Like, I don't need okay. to balance anything. But you know that death is near. Waiting <gasps> for you to make Oh god, that. oh god, I do have Little to balance. Step. Fuck. We can't just push things away. The girl's telling me if I fall, I'll die. Please stop. I'm already so stressed. The world of the dead is ruled by the giantess. Hela, daughter of Loki. Wait, Hela's the, the daughter of Loki? Bad on her mother's side and yet much worse on her father's. He, Marvel also, told me that was child, his sister. The old father cast her down into Helheim and gave her power over confused. those who die of sickness, age, I thought hardship, Hela was Odin's daughter. In all of the nine worlds, only Hela can resurrect the dead. To Hela, your Dillion was sacrificed. And with her, you must bargain. I'm assuming this auto saves, right? Yeah, there's no save option here. Okay, so we've got a stair. 
a ladder down. Oh god, that, oh, that doesn't look correct. Okay. Ugh, why is everything so dark? Auto crouches. Delightful. Love to see it. I've already gotten an achievement called The Fight Begin. Uh oh, fighting tutorial time. Home divides the living from the dead. Is that the face of Hela herself? Whatever horrors lie behind that door, she must find it. Her, like, Shh. willingness to just go up to that and push that open stresses me. Sweet child, oh, someone's here, great. I don't like how the enemies spawn in this game. They We're gonna need to figure out the dodging mechanic. All right, hitting mechanic, very easy. Dodging mechanic, I mean, I could just go to control. Evade, evade is A, I don't like that. A is to climb, drop, and open doors, and then also to evade, I wanted circle, well not circle, B. I still live in PS4 land. Um, I wanted B to be evade, not melee attack. I don't like that. Okay, and then RB is to block. That's good to know. Okay. Nice. Okay. I dig. One really perfectly timed parry. If I'm supposed to not die there, this is a very long death scene. Also, girl, you are not looking great right now. you terrifying to just look at. Oh, I hate it. Oh, her eyes, they're so red. 
vision of what's to come. It's too much. does not bargain it does not reason it is rocked and now it has taken hold it will spread towards her head the seed of the soul until there is nothing left of her <laughs> Her suffering will have been for nothing. It's just a matter of time. The dark rot will grow each time you fail. The rot reaches Senua's head. Her quest is over. And all progress will be lost? Someone told me that wasn't true. The hardest battles are fought in the mind. That is what Dillian taught her. Someone told me that wasn't true, that it was just like a thing to scare you. Defeat, like, I'm all, like I'm not scared already, please. As soon it will take herself. still has control of her mind. And she she looks like one of my friends and I want her to cosplay this girl so back. bad just because their faces look the same. Super creepy. to challenge two gods before I can get to Helheim. So these are the two doors. I'm presuming that's where they would like me to go. Two gods first. Two gods. Two gates. The Northmen say that in the beginning there was nothing but darkness. Bitter cold to the north. Fiery hot to the south. They say the cold formed ice which melted from the sparks from the south. The power of the darkness gave life to the dripping ice. And the first giant was born and was named Emir. The ice continued to drip and the power of the void gave life to it. And it became a cow whose milk fed the giant. That's right, a cow that you weren't expecting. That. <laughs> That's right, a cow. I, I wasn't expecting that. He sure called it. All right, um, I don't know if there's an order, but this one has a skull and like shit on it. So I'm thinking I'm doing this one first. Valraven, ancestor of the seers and master of ravens. Great, he I'm fighting birds. He hunts with his powers of illusion and feasts on their remains. <laughs> Oh, I have to, like, fight them now? Follow the path to Valraven and defeat them in battle to earn his mark. The gate to Helheim. Okay, I think Cannot I have to, like, go through this area. Oh, there is running. Oh, thank God. I don't know if I want to be running. Like, this looks very calming in comparison to what we've seen. Um, but that's when they scare you. See, it's getting darker. Emir was a frost giant, a being of darkness, a 
and all his sons and grandsons were dark after him. Of his daughters and granddaughters, some were monstrous but others fair. But there was another who came from the ice. Burry. In shape, he was like a man, big and powerful. His son, Bor, took a fair giant to be his wife. And they had three sons. Odin was the eldest, and the Northmen hold him to be the foremost of the gods, the Old Father. Okay, I can't go any further up. I guess that was just, uh, do you want more information? I'm very stressed. I like want to run, but I'm also terrified I'm going to run and then I'll just run into one of those little hallucination demons that will scare the shit out of me. Okay, that symbol is here. hides the path to Valraven. Don't trust your eyes. Find another way to see the truth. Don't trust your eyes. Oh. Now she has astigmatism and sees light weirdly. Can relate. <laughs> just me looking at light at lights and at night that's what they all look like weird blinding I made a bridge she did it I do like that when I am successful they cheer me on but before I'm successful they tell me I'm an idiot and I shouldn't do that they're like, don't do what you're doing. Oh, okay. So I could go through here. I have a feeling. Huh? You see Valhalla, there's a portion of the game where you can go... You take a potion and you go into a trance. And when you're in a trance, you go to the, um, the realms. And that's one of the mechanics in that section. You also play as Odin, and you only have one eye. Pretty cool. So you're still your own character, but everyone refers to you as Allfather, and you have, you're missing an eyeball. Actually, you lose your eyeball in throughout that portion of the story. But then once you come out of the trance and you're in like the regular world, that is not a thing. You still have your eyes. There's just a pile, piles, multiple piles of corpses. Uh oh. <laughs> ah! My game is rumbling. My controller is rumbling. Okay, we can do this. It's just how they appear that stresses me the fuck out. Once they're there, I'm fine. <laughs>
they show up. They're just like, hey. She does have a little bit of like a. She's walking more confidently now than she was before. Before she was definitely a little more timid, and now she's walking like, I just fucked up a bunch of dudes. I'm good. That's interesting. She was definitely like a little more huddled over before. But she looks more sure of herself. Determined. I fucking got this. That's the illusion I have to find? Are you fucking kidding? To break his magic seal. That's like Show annoyingly complex. Look how much has changed. How? Well, 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 I bet it's in there. To break the seal, align the ravens with the mark of Valraven. Okay, I see what's up. These things are glowing. I have a feeling I line them up. There we go. Hey, yo. Now we all know puzzles. Puzzles are my thing. I love a good puzzle. It's all the every everything else that I don't like. Like, she's already schizophrenic. Does she need to have astigmatism also? The lights are killing me. This entire game was lit up like this. I'd be fine. Oh, the forest itself. Please watch. More stuff hanging. I wonder if I gotta match those two. I have a feeling I'm gonna have to go to the door first, then match it, and then go back. Another gate. Another gate. Just in case that is. Gotta get up there. Which ravens? Well, can't you see them? Ready to fight him yet. 
I think I gotta line up that stuff first. That's like the rock of this area. No, you don't get this anymore. Um, okay, I can't go that. I gotta go this way. Stress. Mother of Savage. No! Don't! He looks scary! I don't like him! They did say he was like king of the ravens or some shit. He, I don't like him. No, Megusta. Fuck my butt. I'm terrified. Where'd he go? Now that's just sticks with feathers. I have a drink of water. Mabel, you want a treat? I'm stressed. Mabel, you want treats? See how quickly this cat woke up? A little treat. Okay, we can do it. We can do it. I need some... I need like a little, a little emotional support, please. Okay, thanks. Can I have a kiss? No? She's like, fuck you, you get no luck. I'm so scared, I'm gonna walk through this and then he's gonna be like, raw, here I am. I don't like that thing. What if I walk past it and then he attacks me? I'm just gonna be as far back as humanly possible. <laughs> When I hear him growling in my ear, what am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to just walk past him? I feel like I vaguely remember this, and I feel like I got scared. And, like, I feel like there was a jump scare here. Oh, I'm just gonna walk past. Fucker. Can I hit it anyway? No. Where do I go? This area is enclosed. Like, it's a, an arena. It won't let me take out my sword. God, I'm so stressed. I don't know how my heart rate is in the 70s. I'm so stressed that my heart just stopped beating. That seems about accurate. The fact that the noises he's making in my ears are so creepy. Because I don't hear it like surround- Like, I'm wearing just shitty $5 earbuds, but I don't hear it in like surround sound. I hear it on this side, and then it fades, and then it's louder on this side. Like, I can hear him like he's in my head and it's fucking me up so bad um i was hoping that wearing these would minimize that because i played this with full-on headset with my arctis fives um and it was like terrifying so i was like this might be a little bit easier but i might have a hard time figuring out where people are coming from but it won't be as scary and it's doing this even on my shitty earbuds
I'm gonna, I feel like I'm gonna pass this tree and he's gonna be missing again. My guy. You're stressing me out. Unsupported voice oh, down oh, here. When you think hang the weight of a native land. Mm. Living off berries, roots, and feathers. It's not uncommon, you see. You can call such a person again. There he is again. Some like to Then I'm gonna pass under this and he'll be gone again. Mother. Fucking A. The perch occurs. Those who make it back. I don't know why, but that door being locked was weird to me, so. This one, too. I'm unlocking them all. Because they feel like escape routes to me. Also, maybe this is the way. This could be the way. Stressing me out so much, my guy. I feel like they're gonna want me to go up that ladder. They're like, girl, we're not ready for these doors. Let's go back. Yeah, up these stairs, maybe. If there was a ladder to my left. There's that ladder. I didn't see that ladder the first time. This is stressing me. Is that stupid? She can get up now. She can get up now. What's happening? She can get up now. She can get up I can get up now? A trick. Oh, I can get up that ladder. That ladder was not there previously. It's here. Dark magic draws her closer. It's not him. He's helping her. It's not him. It's a trick. She's doing it on her own. He's not tricking her. It's magic. It's an illusion. The voices are now fighting with each other on whether or not it's a trick or magic or if I'm doing it or if he's doing it. And honestly, I just would like to cease to exist at this point. I'm like nauseous with fear right now. <laughs> I'm so scared. Okay, the stairs are there now. They were not there before. This second set of stairs wasn't there. So now I can get up here, and now I can match these. What a terrifying ordeal just to do that. Now I think if I go in there, I'll have to fight him. I feel a little more confident. I still am not, I'm kind of scared of birds, to be honest. So this is just a lot, <laughs> there's a lot going on. I'm scared. Hmm. We picture fear, and we think of a shadow in our heads. There's like a 
whole fucking like mammoth skull in there. If only it were that simple. The worst time comes without warning. Deep primal significance. <gasps> A reminder that just because you cannot see the threat, it doesn't mean that it's not. Like he's there and I don't see him, so now I don't like it. Find your own path. There's a different way. Find your own path. There's a different way. Can I go outside? No, I can't. They blocked that off. It's like, no, you have to go inside where it's creepy. Okay, this is an arena if I ever saw one. God, that was very close. I'm scared because they did mention that every time you fail, she's gonna get more rot up her arm, and if it hits her head, you die. And like, I'm not sure how many deaths that equals. Uh, like, that's the end of the game die. So I'm not sure how much that equals. I do think I can change. I can change it to easy if I need to. Okay, that's good to know. Um, I think with it set on auto, it just matches your skill. I could be wrong. I did not look too far into that. That's where I came from. I think I go up here. I will say, just like Enslaved, I do actually really like the combat. I think the one thing Ninja Theory is really good at is intuitive, smooth combat. That is definitely something that they are just well known for. Um, so I will say that there's that. I do like that. I think enslaved the non like non melee fighting mechanics. Those were a little weird, um, but the fighting mechanics themselves. I think. Ninja Theory's always had very smooth running fighting mechanics. I feel you know like better if I just saw him heart. standing somewhere. Your home, loved ones, to head deep into the wilds. Perhaps I thought that was him tell. standing there. Crow, scarecrow thing. I know what does. They're everywhere. Holy fuck. Because when darkness speaks, it changes everything. Turning home into a foreign land and loved ones. What if he turns into, into one of these? Exile makes sense when you realize that you were never really home in the first place. Mm, don't like when things get blurry. don't like when walls get spiky. I feel 
like I'm dying? Like, why is my heartbeat that slow? I'm panicking. Is this not registering correctly? My heart is actually kind of slow right now. They're like, ma'am, you're dying. I'm also sitting with both my legs up on my seat. Got one leg here, the other leg is curled up under me. Trying to be cozy in this nightmare. Okay. I am like dizzy with upsetty, uh, upsetty spaghetti. I am, oy, not liking any of it. I don't like these stupid scarecrow things everywhere. One there, there and there's one here. It's, it's over there. No, it's here. There's two. It's that one. It's listen, it's focus, two. listen, focus. It's magic. It's, it's magic. It's a delusion. Something in the past is behind it. This reminds her of something. The forest. Where? Which forest? The forest in the wild. The wilds. Fuck? She what I'm thinking. She went to the wilds a long time ago. Why did she go to the wilds? She wanted to fight. I have to make that symbol, and I she think that's gonna tell me which one it is. Did she beat the darkness? No. <laughs> it nearly killed her, but she tried. Druth. Druth helped her. Honestly, it wasn't for Druth. the disrespect of my she can't inner voices. Her it's really rude. She wanted to Stop marry Dylan. So she came to beat her own darkness and marry. But she it didn't work. She cursed. thought her Ooh. curse would affect him. She thought her curse would spread to him. She thought she'd bring the darkness to him too. She, she nearly died. She thought the curse made her tainted. Druth helped her. These women have a lot of faith in Druth. I don't trust this man as far as I could throw him. He straight up said, I'm a liar. And then he said, Truth is my truth. Die. I don't know. Why are you not leaving? Hello? I like, don't see <laughs> That also is missing, like, the bridge, so. I don't know! such an absurd 
third puzzle. There's too many of them. She's like, I have a headache, and now I'm like, me too, actually. That bridge is up, which makes me think that's the way. them both. Am I not, like, good enough for that? I feel like I have to lock on to these things when I'm on that plat- like, one of the platforms. But it's a matter of knowing which one. I hate him. He's so scary. Like, I'm not seeing anything matching up. It's also such a weirdly complicated symbol, and there's so many pieces, like... I don't know. I feel like I can't even get to the platforms until I figure this out. I feel like they're, that is what will unlock them? These mirrored images though, like these lights are giving me headache. I, oh, it's not helpful at all. Hi, how are you? What is going on? I go up here. Let's make that symbol. But where? I really thought I'd turn around and it would just be like, oh, there it is. Boy, oh, was I wrong. How in the hell? That one looks like it could be the start of something, but it ain't. Oh, that's fire, honey. You can't walk there. Oh god, we're- mm. Annoying puzzle. Voices are literally making me nauseous. Like, I'm so uncomfortable by them. Like, sir, can I just fight you? He's just like looking at me menacingly. Like, just, just portal me up there. He's like, no, you must find the light puzzle. I don't want to do the light puzzle. I don't like it anymore. I hate crow- I hate birds. I fucking hate birds. These all look like shrimp to me. Like, it just looks like floating, glowing shrimp. I'm not seeing this- I'm not seeing anything looking even remotely like this symbol.
The other ones were way more obvious. This one's ridiculous. I'm gonna get the shit scared out of me because I'm lost and confused. They're gonna punish me for being stupid. I strongly feel that way. To magically line up these symbols so that they do something. My voices are getting louder and they're stressing me. They're stressing me. Like you're right there. Just fight me, damn it. the fuck honestly honestly i'm getting so frustrated most of these don't even line up at any angle don't line up with each other i wish they would go away once you're like they don't line up and you get rid of them that's what's making it difficult like i can't figure out Contemplating cheating at this point. voice just keep calling me dumb which is not doing anything for my self-esteem Here, but I'm like, where, where else can I go? I don't think I walked across here, though. Oh, I did, actually. Now that I'm looking at the angle that the other one is standing at, I'm like, oh, I was here. Damn it. Like, none of these line up and they all look like shrimp. How am I supposed to make that dumb symbol? I'm only seeing shrimp symbol. Also, I have shrimp in my freezer, so it kind of just makes me hungry. man, could you just, like, either fight me or, or 
tell me where your dumb light puzzle is. Where's the answer? And then, then we can fight after that. standing right there and will not fight me is frankly rude. Bro, come on. Okay, I think I got all the bridges down at least. I'm suffering from that thing where I was scared shitless until this puzzle got ridiculous, and now I'm not scared, now I'm just angry. Frustrating for no reason. Like, let me just fight stuff. I could be here for like the next 12 hours and still not get this dumb puzzle. Too large of a clump, I really thought something would match. Um, yeah, I think I'm gonna resort towards looking it up because it's annoying. Alright, let's see. Let's see. I wanna play this damn game. Raven puzzle. Final puzzle? Mm, I'll just do two Val Raven. Because I don't know if this is the final. Second gate. I need to open another gate. Hold on, hold on. Okay. Rather big area, we really need to open another gate. Begin by approaching the main door to get the symbol from them, then go down and go through the portal to reveal another hidden this is before I did all of this. Underneath the plank unlock the gate. The ladder up. One more of these trips, go to the portal, blah 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 blah. I did all this. I'm reading this walkthrough and I still don't understand what I'm I like still don't understand the instructions of the walkthrough so this is gonna just be awful something about looping and looping and looping and a portal and looping in the portal um, this is like the only portal I can think of it doesn't match the picture that they showed me so this is not a bridge, and I cannot jump across. The portal this way. I don't see a 
a difference between these two. Oh wait, okay, that was that wooden plank. Remember that wooden plank I ran across? Okay, so they want me to, that's what they wanted me to do. So I gotta run through, I guess this way? The wooden plank here? Yes, okay, the wooden plank is here. Okay, so I did that before. Missed something after. Something about like continuously looping through different portals to get different illusions. Pain in the ass is basically what they're telling me. They're like, we did so good with the game, with the level combat design, but nothing else. Everything else will hurt your feelings. Ladder up there, but I don't see a way of getting it. Another portal that there is. There's one over here. Oh, I have to cross that bridge. Okay, so this portal I think adds something as well. I haven't figured out what it adds. Nothing from here looks different. Maybe it's this side. No? Oh, yes. See that? Nothing. Together. That's the gate I can't open, though. So I feel like this is the way. But I don't know how to open that gate. Okay, so I think I was on the right path. Um, we gotta figure out how to open that gate. It can only be opened from the other side. Another portal down there. And there's a portal here. This is closed. I wonder if through this portal it's open. Still closed. That thing just scared the fuck out of me. Okay. don't see what this portal is doing, so I don't want to go through it. That guy, though, he's the one. It's that one. I can feel it. This feels right. go down here. There's a portal there. Hold on. There's a portal there, but... No, it's still there in... in I can't go down this way. Do I go through? I'm just afraid it's changing stuff, but I can't figure out what that one changed. It will not let me down there. I went through it, and I don't know what it changed. This is all the same. All of this is the same. Like, I don't know what it changed. Everything 
thing looks fucking identical. I'm so confused. If anyone wants to help, I won't be mad. <sighs> I'm so fucking lost. This whole, the rest of the stream is just gonna be me running around in circles, because I don't get it. This is all the same. It's all blocked. I can't get through anywhere. You're telling me no, which makes me think I'm going the wrong way. Like, what do I do? Uh, the fact that I don't understand the walkthrough says a lot. Says a lot. I have a feeling I'm going to be more frustrated with this game than scared of it. Because shit like this is stupid. change no change that's what's super weird oh my god i see the change i'm an idiot it's that door it's open oh now it's just regular people open because i walked through it i got it now that's open now i gotta figure out how to get across again okay 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 i think i think we did it did it. First, before I get to him, let's unlock this. Just in case anything happens, I now have an easy way in and out without needing to use those tunnels. Those weird portal things. There are no steps there, but there's this platform and ladder. Alright, now I'm back to being terrified. <laughs> now that I'm a little more confident I figured it out. At least I'm closer to figuring it out. Because he is right there. Ooh, how do I get there? Surely I can't, like, jump. What's in this sneaky crawl space? Ooh. Ooh, a clue. The Northmen say that Odin and his brothers killed Ymir, and that the world of man was formed from his corpse. They made his bones into stone, and his flesh into earth, and his blood into the salt sea. They set his skull to be the bowl of the sky. Why well, is a his really big head of his clouds. skull is the whole sky. Odin and his brothers caught the sparks flying from Muspel and fluffy. made them into stars. And to protect the new world from the giants, they used Ymir's great curving eyebrows as walls. Yeah. Your eyebrows, your whole ass eyebrows are walls? I have to draw these fuckers in. Your eyebrows are walls? That's aggressive. This kind of sounds like the roast of Ymir, if you ask me. Okay, we are so fucking close. That's a way up, but it didn't look like I could... <gasps> Wait, I got it. I got it. I figured it out. I figured it out. Okay. So that wall... Now that I have this door open... 
I need to close that wall so I can continue across that path. I got it. Boom, I just got it. Okay, so that's open. I need that wall closed. Uh, I think I can go this way and it'll close. Nope, how do I close it? How do we uh, get rid of that wall? I need that wall to go bye-bye. Is there a different portal I can use to like reset it? I don't know if that reset it. We're just gonna try it out. It's open still. I don't like that. Let's just close that wall. Oh, wait. Yes! Okay. Gotta go through it multiple times. That's fine. Alright, so it's closed. So now when I go through that gate that I just opened and I climb up, I can get across the entire thing because there's not a gap anymore in that wall. Okay. I feel like he's just going to escape again. I'm going to finally get there and he's going to be like, oh, I left. Sorry. Still there. Still there. Where is he? He's gone. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? I'm not gonna lie, I was terrified that I would cross here and he'd be like standing right there like, hello? not seeing a difference. But I'm gonna go through anyway. I know. My voices are telling me no. I never know if I should listen to them. They are a little bit toxic, to be honest. Oh, okay, I see. So this has a bunch of lights, but when I go through here, it actually eliminates a bunch of them. The ravens. They're gone. They're gone. No, half of them have gone. They've gone. He's not helping. It's true. Quiet. Yeah, I can't think either. I'm going to be honest. Like, these voices make it really difficult to, to think. I wonder if this one will hide some also. It does, look. If you look to the left, if you look to the left of here, when I look through, that one's not there. So this is hiding them too. Or not. Like hit them and then it brought them back. Okay. No. I 
want to know how to get to, to that one, because I feel that's the one I haven't touched, and I feel like that one is going to do something, too. I don't know how to get there, though. Voices keeps asking if I'm lost. Yeah, obviously. Right, I need that back. was good, but I need to get to that one. I need to get there, but I don't know how. I can't climb and I can't drop. I feel like, so there were two of him, and so this one is now gone, so I'm wondering if I have to go towards the other side, and maybe I can loop around do the puzzle to get to that platform, and then maybe that would eliminate more of those symbols. I'm really, like, running out of brain power here. the other guys up there. I'm thinking maybe we gotta figure out. There's another portal up there, so I think if I can get up there and go to that portal, that maybe it would lead me in the right direction. I don't think these stairs were here before. Those stairs were not here before. I think they came in with that platform on his, on the first level. And now he's gone. Okay, fair. Yep, and more symbols disappear. The ravens. And now I see the three that need to tie together. Where have they gone? Gone. She did it for the Looking back, I was so naive to think she could banish it on her own. The further she saw into the darkness, the more she struggled to see anything at all. I have such a hard time figuring out the what smallest hints of shape. is Senua and what is... There we go. Grew in strength until they consumed her whole. Before she knew shape. the 
darkness had her in its claws. Bitch, I'm gonna take you on. Alright. Will she find Dillian before her time comes? Hey, well, before we go in, I'm gonna give you another snack. Uh, reward Mabel for being a good emotional support kitty. Hey! And you need to get your claws cut. at me okay we're gonna do it guys we're gonna do it we're gonna do it i really don't like birds so this is like a lot I'm very stressed he's just like gigantic fucking bird here he is chilling up top in like a, a nest a lot man in a nest Come on. Oh, you fucker. Why? Well, this is an arena, so I'm here to battle. Before we do that, I just want to remind myself Invade is A, block is RB. Okay, so the only thing on the left, movement. Okay. I'm so tired of looking for this fucking symbol. Are you kidding me? It's another portal. We both send darkness. We can fight it together. That's two of the pieces, because I can see how those would fit. There's a portal up there. than this. Gave Mabel a treat rather prematurely. <gasps> that tree, that tree extends, so now it's a full bridge. Okay. Speak to me, Drew. I would love if we can get this part Tell done. The story. Uh, it's so, the first gate. Listen, we have to defeat two gods. I will tell you so this is the first one, so if we can defeat the first one this and time, and the second one on Wednesday, Morton, we'll be in good start, because then we, Helheim is the biggest part of the game. If they took but his goal, we'd be in a good chains, place if we can do that. So I have like another hour to stream. Like I think we can do that. I don't know and how many more least, puzzles. It's been so long since I played this, so I'm not 100% sure of how many puzzles are left. Before I even get to the boss, his father burnt to death. I'm hoping it's not his too many. Was killed, but he 
he is Honestly, who the fuck knows? Sorrow in his heart. It is quack. His father's enemies offered redress for his loss right. and invited There's him another to portal feast. up there. It was at a hall near the sea. Definitely when needs to be came, up. They betrayed him to the Northmen, who enslaved him and took him to hell. Six years later, his slave Look at that. Nothing. No bridge. Burning all bridge. before them. Love to see and it. into that fire, Findon made his escape. What was Findon? Burnt away that day. But from the flames, a new man stepped uh, forward. Ruth that looks like a very was born. tall drop. Ruth. The man that I am now. Also, I feel like more people should cosplay Senua. She looks again. so creepy and badass like it's just good it is just good character design i wish you could have seen my home before these dark times i can whoa 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 i cannot focus while i'm on this tree which is not what i was hoping for i also cannot go up this tree only go across Thing holds on like you're gonna. I don't know. Do what? You don't have any options. You only get to hold on. Period. Um. Was this like that before? Where did I come in? I did not come in through here. I don't know where I came through. Okay. I think I gotta go back around the tree. I think I have to match up the icons from the bottom to the top, possibly. Because that one is so high up. Oh, I came in through there. I really hope someone else with astigmatism is watching this and is looking at those annoying lights and they're like, hey, it looks like stoplights at night because that's all I keep thinking about. I was thinking of these three matching, but they look like they're going to match up in that nest. How do I get to that nest? How do we do that? Getting closer. My goal. It's 10 o'clock now. My goal is that by 11, we take this guy's ass, this guy's ass down. Nothing different. Literally just that tree. Oh, I wonder. to get to that nest and there's two trees that converge and I cannot get on either of those trees I can get on this one but it doesn't take me to where I actually need to go jump up here. I think I gotta go back around. Yeah. I can jump down a considerable height. I cannot jump up very high. Like that that little like log is pretty much the highest I can jump. She doesn't really jump. She kind of just leaps up, like steps over and that's it. <sighs> okay. 
Okay, so we're gonna go back around. is confusing the portal mechanic is cool i think it might be a little bit overused even just at this point like we are only two hours into this game but i feel like it's a little a little bit weird a little bit too much so i'm hoping that maybe this is the mechanic for this boss and it's not for the whole game I don't 100% remember. Oh, to see if I can go across this tree. And I can't because this branch is in the way. This wiggly branch is in the way to going up. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Oh, wait, I have an idea. Because I have this bridge unlocked, I wonder if something else changes when I get rid of that log bridge. That log bridge that is here. I wonder if I do this. <gasps> I can go past that tree. Delightful. Mm. Okay, 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 we're getting it, we're getting it. We're doing the thing, we're doing it. Now I should be able to cross. Onto the nest, and the nest is where the icons are all going to match. Oh shit, I don't like this. Oh, fuck. I'm now part bird and I'm just sleeping in the nest and now he's my mom. I remember. It didn't end well in the wild. Her eyes are so expressive. They scare the shit out of me. They're really scary. You think you can overcome his darkness? What is going on behind? Make sense of it. And what? Relief settles in. Strong sound now. Turn the helpless feet back into the maelstrom. Down on the mind. I'm being the eaten by birds. Deeper. Deeper. Dragging at me. Down so far into the void that maybe this time there is no coming back. Help me. But there, Help. in the darkness. Come to think of it, I think I beat you him and then I never played her. this game again. Hear me. Reach out to me. Help me. Senua, take my iron mirror. Look into it. For it is a window into the underworld. Within, you will see the face of the darkness that you fear. And if you focus, like I have taught you to, you will also see that as much as the I'm darkness pressing the has focus been trapped buttons, within its but I don't veil, think anything's happening. Is trapped within yours. Focus. Focus. I'm pressing so many buttons. Focus. I see you. I see you now. You led me to the wild. You trapped me there. Right. 
Hold on. <laughs> I looked at the controls so long ago. I know that the fighting is all on the right side of the controller, but I just want to check. All right. So <laughs> we've got evade is A and RB is block. Those are the two things I was um, the most concerned about. accidentally hit the trigger which is focus instead of the button which is block and it did that slow-mo Zach Galifianakis hunger like hungover like hangover map sequence oh shit all right that is a dodge that one is a dodge did not just fuss Rodami in my face. Excuse me. I hate birds so much. Like, with the fiery fucking passion. Oh my god. He's okay, that little, like, spin attack thing is severe. There's no health bar. So it's like, it's hard to judge how many hits after your screen is pulsating red. It's hard to figure out, like, how many times can I get hit before I die? Like, you just gotta dodge around until it stops being so red. Well, that makes sense, because Heavenly Sword is also a Ninja Theory game. Um, this is actually supposed to be kind of like a spiritual successor to Heavenly Sword. So that extra makes sense. Um, I feel like they were like, we are done with that series, but... And then this it kind of developed into that. So that actually totally does make sense. Go. Yeah. I thought that was- I read that the other day, I actually thought that was super interesting. Um, I played a little bit of Heavenly Sword. Not enough to, uh, have a full opinion on it. But I did like what I did play. I don't really know why I didn't finish it. Finish this! End it now! They surround you! Stop giving me two! It's hard to have two! my people she just told me evade and i jumped back and i missed he didn't hit me i should listen to the voices in my head <laughs>
boomeranged me. That's cheating. I didn't know you can boomerang a weapon. I don't know that. It's not over yet. Honestly, these are like welcoming at this point. At this point, I'm excited about these two guys. Don't let them surround you is the biggest thing because you can only see one at a time. Like they they auto-focus you on when there's more than one, they auto-focus you on the enemy. So if there's two of them, I have to make sure that the second one is still in my line of vision. Otherwise he can come up behind me and I'll never see him. It's a little bit irritating. Three is very rude. Oh no. In the tutorial fight in the beginning, I fought like five or six of the regular guys, and then there were two of them that showed up and they were all shadow, and I was like, what the fuck? I couldn't do anything, but I didn't have the focus, like I didn't, I hadn't learned it through the story yet. No. A good fight. I actually like that one. It was stressful. Stressful. But not this time. I feel like I gotta check my my heart because my resting today has been like seven very low for me. But we did we did peak around the high nineties. All right, that was a good fight. The mark of Val Raven, one of the keys to the gate to Helheim. Hold it in your mind's eye. With every battle, the darkness they, they do a good job. See, like now I'm back in my seventies. They do a good job of like building up suspense for way too long. Like it's tons of suspense, and that's the shit that stresses me out. Like that's anxiety. Anxiety is just always being letting go suspenseful, like in everyday life. So playing this is not an escape at all. <laughs> like playing this is terrible. She would not have heard his stories of the Northmen. Okay, so it's only 10 She would not have the so chance to find Dillion's soul. We can actually start the second area. I'm coming. That's the name. Achievement unlocked. Master of Illusion. Well, now it's bright out. Grassy and nice. Everything looked like death before. Look at this greenery. Beautiful. Alright, so that focus, when I would focus and it turned everything slow motion black and white, that was the reflection from the mirror. Because if you looked on the back, it would spiral, and once it was full, I was able to, like, use it. So I was, like, pretty. So 
still got some death and shit, but there's greenery that wasn't here before. The sun is shining. When she was younger, she'd lay in the grass and stare at the clouds. And then she saw them. Elusive. Shifting faces. After a while, she could see the face of everyone. From the trees. The mountains. The caves. Guessing through this door? I guess we have to head out from where we came, I'm thinking, so we can get back to that door. The yellow door is the second god we have to fight. Now, I am pretty sure I did not do that part. Um, I'm pretty sure this was the end in my first time I attempted this game. Pretty sure this is where I ended. Can you see the faces too? Um, oof. And it just opens my gate. I live in an apartment building, but there's like, we have a metal, a big metal gate, and it creaks whenever it opens, and it just opened. It was too scary. This is where I came from, right? I think. I think. Well, we got an autosave symbol, so that's terrifying. Um, I've never seen a game autosave and then felt good about it. Like, I'm always like, oh shit, what's gonna happen now? But it's probably just because I'm exiting an area. Yeah, this is where I came from, because I remember looking at that stone. It, never mind. There was a stone somewhere. Here? I don't remember. It was somewhere. Oh shit. I don't know why, but for some reason I thought I saw it. But maybe I didn't. Maybe I'm crazy. like a almost like a frame rate drop like they look really choppy but intentional i don't know it kind of reminds me of like when in when quentin tarantino in kill bill does like those zoom in zoom free zoom free zoom freeze and like kill bill in like all the action sequences <laughs> leaning back as I'm playing like don't hit me he's in here I'm I'm safe relax is that it 
I love watching her put the sword back, because then I can breathe again. There's another challenge. I don't know why. There was a weird glint in like the shadow. I don't know what it was, but I like could sense that I was going to fight them. Like I saw a glimmer. Did I, I did this one already. Okay. Super weird. And then it happened like right after I saw it. What do I have to do? <laughs> My voices are not telling me what to do. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Okay, I just realized. Hold on. I just realized where I was. That is the gate to Helheim. I can't get to Helheim until I beat this god as well. Um... This is the second one. Sort, the fire giant has answered. He comes from a land older than mankind. And the Northmen call upon his flaming sword to raise their enemies to the ground. actually just genuinely curious because I'm maybe like two hours into this game which is not that much I'm curious as to how long it is to beat this game um, I want to say when I googled it last time it was 15 hours main story seven and a half hours oh oh on average it says eight hours I genuinely didn't think it was that short, but that's, that's fine. Okay. I was just curious. I didn't think it was that short of a game. She found the wretched old pool on her way back from the wilds. Oh, there's a face it's in that waterfall. She took pity on him, for he was not long for this world. I hate it. I spoke of his own darkness. The North Man. Um, this area is beautiful, so I can't wait to die. Uh, <laughs> every time it looks nice, I'm like, it's gonna be scary. New York, that's where I live. You're like, girl, shut up. just had like memory unlocked so actually when it's black and white and it's got that choppy kind of sh 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 fighting it reminds me of the movie 13 ghosts because whenever they would introduce a new ghost they'd be in those like glass tunnels and the glass walls have like spells written on them to keep them enclosed in that area and anytime the ghosts would show up they would do that kind of like movement to like zoom in on them and be like look how scary that's what it reminds
the wall. All right, that was not good. It, like it feels like you're doing something like okay i have to find new york i can't the rune is just my city fine fine all right this once i get through that through this whole thing is going to be fire themed i'm guessing yes i heard this grace okay are we thinking these trees they look sus Um, these trees are just so weird. Like, why are they like this? They have to be. Oh wait, here's wise though. Oh, I have to find one at a time. That's fair. Is that not enough? Okay, they're like, that's the Y, but you need to find the N and the Y. I'm gonna be honest, finding, finding the symbols is the worst part of this game. It's just not fun. And it's frustrating. Are they still there? I'd rather it be frustrating because it's like a tough boss than because it's like I can't find the letters. It's dumb. keep telling me to find the why and then I find like millions of them and they're like cool now find both things at the same time and I'm like why are you making me find whys then like I thought I lined up line up this that's my why that's not my end Saying there it is, but like, where my queen? Are they still there? Like that looks like that could be the Y, and then maybe these two bits could be the N. But I gotta figure out the. Cro I feel like I'm maybe just not at the right height, but I think I maybe have the right objects. My voice just gets higher as I get more confused. Um, I did not realize I could go up here. Uh oh. Got really crinkly up here. Oh, there's my end. A Y literally in the background. 
Is that what I have to do? Just one? Is that what it was? Like, I don't- I thought I needed to find them together. They're like, nah, just- just one is fine. Got some ideas. Why? You're not accepting this as the why? Okay, interesting. Um, got 75 different options on the why. I think that one was a good one, but eh, fine. Fine, fine, fine. This whole time I really thought they meant, like, to find them together. Not just one at a time. One at a time seems too easy. Is that the why? Did I just find the why? The why? Can you go why? Mm, if no? That stick, this one random stick feels correct to me. I just can't explain why. Mm. There's, there's leaves on that one. It's not that one. But, like, maybe it is. You can hear it in the sky. Things. One random stick has me. said that one random stick was gonna be it because there was no fucking way that everything else had very shapely trees and then there's just this one random little stick i knew it mabel i knew it she's like that's nice i want to go to bed Oh god, I don't like hanging bodies. Why do they do this to me? When they oh, first came my god, my god, my god. I knew enough of their tongue to beg for mercy. And it took me to see it. I wish now that they had slaughtered me like the others. I rode their storm of fire, death, slavery, many lives. This darkness you speak of? <laughs> I know it well. And I'm still here. Anytime the screen gets like that ashy noise kind of look, that's when I know there's a fight. Also, I mean, look at this. This is set up like an arena. Oh, the hanging bodies, though. Oh, I fucking hate this guy. The shield guy is just not for me, you know? I'm not into it. Like, I want to hit them, but I'm also, like, scared. I don't want to be in this, backed in this corner. Fuck, now I'm between them. Other one is not shielded. Also, the shielding is the bad part. Oh fuck!
that. Stop them. Shit. Girl, 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 get up, get up, get up. Shielded guy is pissing on us. They really gave me another shielded guy. Come on. I it took me so long to beat that one. I hate it. I hate it. Fuck. Stop giving me people. So many. voice in my head telling me they're winning. I think that's really rude. And she should mind her fucking business. Cheer me on. Find a good position. Some of them are giving me good tips. Some of them are just telling me I'm terrible. Like, girl, we know. you're gonna have to slaughter it's so many it's so many i'm stressed it's I'm nearly stressed. over Finish it. the one girl that keeps telling me it's nearly over she has been saying that since i beat the first one so she's like she's that friend that you know you talk to and you're like i'm going through something it's really horrible i'm having the worst day and she's like it's fine you'll get over it she's that friend no one wants that friend the one girl who tells me to evade, love her. It's it's correct every time. The second I hear it, I do it. It works. Um, yeah, so in conclusion, the woman who keeps telling me it's almost over is rude, and I don't like her. Get out of my fucking head. Oh shit, I ran right into that man's face. Let's put some space. Jump back, jump sideways. Back sideways. After I hit him. Oh. I'm like stuck to the edge. <laughs> I'm hoping this is the last guy because they haven't given me a second. I've had two people the whole time until this guy. So I'm hoping he's the last one. Hey, okay, the girl who tells me to evade, a fucking queen. I hope she's having a lovely time in my head. Jesus Christ. That was a lot. I will say, they're not that difficult to beat, so they really do have to give you, like, mobs of them in order for it to feel any little bit of challenging. Know that only you only have like three attacks and then an evade and a block that's all you have find the fire Senua, to follow the path to suit you have a light attack a heavy attack and then a charge attack evade block that's it um are you telling me to go through here what are you telling me what are you telling me uh-huh. What do I have to do? Un 
surprisingly, the men's voices are not helpful. What is wrong with my heart rate? I'm dying. How is it so low? I'm sorry, the what? I don't want anything called the sacrifice. Why is that wiggly? I don't like it. Does not you cannot win. overcome suffering. You refuse to look at it. I refuse to look at it. He's probably like, you blinked once. That man does not blink. I don't like him in my head, to be honest. Okay, so where the portals were, the last illusion, I have a feeling um, setting the fires is going to be the new illusion to get through to different areas. Um, this entire game is full of How illusions. You can't tell. She, she is schizophrenic? Question mark? Um, so, he's imagining things that are not here. I have a feeling he's going to find it. Burn that down. Okay, there's a log up there. story. Before the Earth was created, there was a world called Muspelos. Because it was in the south, it was bright and hot, flaming, burning. Sparks that flew out from Muspel became the stars. Other sparks melted ice in the frozen world of Niflheim, creating the body of the first giant, Emir. Bang. Muspelos is one of the nine worlds. And is now the land of fire, fire giants. giants. Fucking great. <laughs> so excited. Cannot endure a journey there. Great, I'm in the land of fire giants. Sounds fucking awesome. Um, so usually I would end stream in like 15 minutes. I don't have work this week. I'm on vacation. So I'm thinking, um, maybe I'll stream until 12. I stopped doing that because I used to do it. I stopped doing that because I was really like not getting good sleep and um, having to work, even working from home. I've got a cat that wakes me up at four o'clock in the morning every single day. So to go to bed at 12 and wake up at four and then not be able to go back to sleep um, was really tough. I'm yawning now because I keep saying the word sleep. Um, another gate, another sacrifice. Just another day in the mines. Um, yeah, I think maybe we can stream till 12. Let's see if... I don't... Mm, I don't think we can beat... We might be, but I don't think we can beat this, uh... Area by 12. Let's see. Let's see what we it's do. It's too far. She'll never find it. She'll never make her way back. She needs to remember the way back. What happens when she finds it? Then what? It's just that she needs to remember the way back. Um, I have no sense of direction. So actually, I will not. She won't. She won't be able to tell her. The one that keeps laughing at me is such a fucking mean girl. What's in here? This looks damaging. This looks horrible. The North. 
Hoffman made fire sacrifices, burning slaves like me to reveal the path to soot. Here you go, man. I searched path for to soot. And our suffering. I guess that's who I'm fighting eyes. at the end of this section, which is just, I just scream great. Helpless pigs. Simba. You're the Simba. Are you? You're the Simba. You're not gonna do it this time? Here you go. Oh, I don't like that scream. Oh, that scream stressed me. Oh no. Is that a baby? I didn't get through fast enough, I think. Oh no! Fuck. Oh shit. Every time I fail, the rot goes up her arm and if it gets to her head, it's game over. Considering this game is eight hours long and I'm throwing three into it today, I guess I'm doing good. Now I know what way I'm going. This way. I ran around that like three times. I have no idea what it is. I did not realize. Oh god, it's wrong screen is too much. It's like a goat or a baby or both. Like that, that screen is so blow up. Do your gods answer your Can he prayers, blink Samuel? one time? I asked the gods for mercy, all of them, even theirs. None answered. In the end, I set myself free. I feel like find he's gonna God, ask me if I put my find name in the goblet of fire. Like I find Jesus. mine. <laughs> my gods abandoned me. I am alone. Girl, you're only now realizing the gods abandoned you. Look at your life. Like, I promise you, the gods have not given a fuck this whole time. I don't like this. That looks like Kratos' house in God of War. So we also have more symbols. But if you played the newer God of War, does this not look exactly like the house that Kratos and, uh, what's his face? Boy, Atreus. It looks like this. Hello? Anyone home? Hello? Hello, hello? for like the sacrifice podium of a good sacrifice oh but we've got this the northmen say that the defender of muspel is called cert the foremost of the fire giants his name means the black one because he is like something burnt is that where the word the northmen came believe from? that he sits at the border of muspel with his flaming sword and at the end of the world, he will leave his post. He will travel to Asgard and Midgard, 
waging war against all the gods, he will be victorious, and then burn the whole world with fire. I also just noticed that around the circle, some of them are white. I think those are the ones I found. And then the other ones are like, it looks like I probably missed three of them. Um, I wonder if that is true. That's pretty cool, if so. Okay, I definitely feel like sacrificing the house is going to be part of it, but this is also a thing. <sighs> Infinity R. The Northmen of Hell okay. worship the devourers, insatiable gods of darkness. I come from Eren, the King Senora, where I once followed my own gods. Yeah, so we're like locking up already. will show up, I think, when you're in the general vicinity of where something is. Like you, Senua. The man I once was has died. And when that happens... Oh, there's a lot of trees. You worship can die I'm wondering you. if some of those trees maybe play a part in stuff here. <laughs> there's a lot of crisscrossy trees also. Mm -hmm. oh, well, I definitely think I found that. No? No? Gotta close them up? Not... No? Okay. Okay. It looks it to me... Oh, wait. Mm. Oh, ho, ho. That looks like a little bit of it, but I need to close that stuff. Okay, I'm closer to the R, because now the R's are showing up. So many bits on this house are like angular, like they look like they would possibly fit. I feel like the R is somewhere in this piece. I don't know how. What is with this tree having these, like, ovals carved? Or it's not a tree, it's a log. I was like, that's a weird tree. It's purposely carved. It is a log. It is for decoration. Huh. Now, these are, like, A-frames, which makes me think of the R. It's got that angle. I thought the infinity symbol thingy one would be easier. They could also be inside of this house. I did not even look in there. But there's so much crisscrossy shit going on. <laughs> I was gonna say that crisscross on that tree was too sus. 
Um, all right, I have a feeling the R might be inside. Showing up. Oh, okay. Like the sim, the little red symbols aren't showing up anywhere. Up oh, here we go. That's a sign that they're they're near. Not focused while I'm on the roof. Not gonna be from that angle. Like a white R flash. That was so hard. I like just, if I didn't glance over there by accident, that would have never been found. I would have never found that, but it is incredibly obvious now that I'm looking at it. I don't think it was glowing like that before. Because that's intense. Like, how did I not see that? Okay, so I'm thinking that the sacrifice is maybe behind this gate. And we're gonna have to run all the way. Yeah, the voices were right. I do need to memorize where to go. Like, I do need to pay attention. Oh, here it is. Perfect. Okay, so it should be a straight shot. Simba. A little Rafiki action. I dig. <laughs> She keeps doing it, and she kind of acts like she's a little surprised every time. She Not a straight shot. They're gonna make me run through the house. you need to kill this man. Fair. And he's all ashy. Still the same characters, but they're ashy because fire. Once is this man playing. Three hours into this Run! game, no blinks. Only then, as with a newborn, do they see the world anew. No, they see nothing now. My fear is that if I keep playing, I'm not gonna. Like, we're gonna finish this game by Wednesday, and I don't have that many scary games. 
to play, um, and we have a whole month of this. So I'm wondering, that's where I'm teetering back and forth on whether or not I should stop now or play for another hour. Um, my plan was to have this fill three streams, and I feel like if I keep playing, I'm going to finish it on Wednesday. Which unfortunately is a thing I keep doing. I finish games way quicker than I intend, almost every time. I definitely don't want that to happen. So is there a way to be like, save? I do this. No, because you didn't tell me that you're saving. I guess I saved right before I did that. I'm assuming. Yeah, I'm kind of leaning towards ending stream now so that on Wednesday and Friday we can still play this. Because if this is going to be like eight hours of gameplay, um, that means for me it's probably nine because I'm not good at this. Um, and I'm bad at puzzles. <laughs> Love puzzles, terrible at them. So I think I'm just going to end here. We'll finish. We'll pick this up on Wednesday and probably finish this Friday. Next week on Tuesday, Back for Blood comes out. I will be playing Back for Blood that Wednesday, but we're not going to play that going straight out. From that point, we'll do like one day a week. Um, and anyone in chat, anyone who wants to play with me, like it's a four person co-op. So anyone who wants to play, if there's space for you, you're good to play. Um, if you join my Discord, I have not, this is my first stream back on Twitch. I have not checked to see if that works. Does it? I'm guessing it doesn't. Um, shit. I'll post, I'll tweet it. I'll tweet my Discord, underscore Marie Gray is my Twitter. Um, I'll, I'll tweet a link to my Discord. But yeah, so if you guys want to play Back for Blood with me, I think one day a week, I'm leaning towards Fridays. Um, we're going to have just like a community night Back for Blood uh, where we can all just hang out and play. Um, that first stream, which it comes out October 12th, but, so that first stream is October 13th, that Wednesday. Though I did pre-order the deluxe package. I think I actually get the game four days early. I have to look into that. If I do, then on Monday I'll do the first Back for Blood stream. But the most important part of that is the first Back for Blood stream is going to be Back for Blood stream. Did I say that correctly? Um, is going to be a cosplay stream. I will be in cosplay as Holly from the game. Her shirt still sitting here because I still need to take it in. Um, it is like two sizes too big. So, um, so yeah, so we'll cosplay Holly either on Monday or Wednesday. I gotta look into that situation. But then from there, every Friday will be a Back for Blood community night. And then the other days I'm gonna play different scary games. Um, I still have Detention, which I bought the last time I did like a week of scary games we never got around to detention that i think is like a four hour game so that'll be just one stream um i've got a couple of others too yeah i'm gonna scare myself for the whole month um i am really liking this game i'm kind of glad i pushed forward i'm already past i'm already past what i had played um the first time around like the first time I played, I had already quit this game with where I am now. Um, it is pretty scary. It's it's a different scary, though. It's, like, suspenseful in a way where it just continuously builds up and builds up and builds up, and then it's terrifying. Um, so, yeah, it kind of sets me into, like, a panic. The way they do the voices, I'm contemplating... Maybe next stream I'll actually wear my Arctic my Arctis Fives because they have like the surround sound. It's like an actual headset, so they have the full surround sound. I'm curious to hear 
how shit my pants terrifying the voices are because in my stupid shitty earbuds they do a really good job of left right balance and like it fading out and fading in um so you can like hear the voices almost like they're moving in your head so yeah i gotta dig through i have just like a like a normal person i have just a bin of random electronics and cords I need to dig through that bin. I'm pretty sure that's where my headset is, because um, I use it for my PS4 usually, so I'm pretty sure it's by the PS4. Um, yeah, I think that's going to be it for me tonight. Mabel is past her bedtime. Mabel, you want a treat? You did so good today, baby. You're such a good girl. You want a little treat? We'll do one treat. You get one treat. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Stop licking my fingers. PS3. No, PS4. PS4. I don't even own a PS3. I went from PS2, Xbox 360, PS4. Um, and I personally think that was the right choice for me because that's how I fell in love with Left 4 Dead, Left 4 Dead 2, and now Back for Blood, so I'm very excited for that. Ugh. You licked me a lot, baby. Um, I hope you guys just heard her chirp directly into my microphone. Um, so yeah, but yeah, my PS4, which I do still play, um, occasionally. The benefit of the of the console is that I can lay on my couch and play a video game. Where I can't, like, lay... This chair is comfortable, don't get me wrong. Like, it's comfortable. But, like, I can't be, like, fully horizontal and playing a PC game. It doesn't work. Not with the way my office is set up. So, like, it's nice to have a single-player game. Um, like, I played all of AC Valhalla laying down. The entire game. Just laying down on my side with Mabel, like, in my stomach. Playing, playing video games. So it's a nice way yeah it's just like it's good for like an open world game where you just want to like run around and explore and you're just like mm, I'm gonna be cozy on my couch and explore a, a new world like so i played all of ac valhalla literally laying down on my couch it was great this is why i designed my office area so i can shove the couch behind the desk so that is my plan for when i move when i buy a place and move is i want to have Still an L-shaped desk, but in a corner of a room. The issue is this office is technically part of my living room. Um, you can sort of see it here, but I don't have a wall. This is a d room divider. I don't have an actual wall because my living room is 30 feet long, and who the fuck needs that? So I separated it into two rooms. Now I have a huge office and a living room, but my huge office... I don't have any free walls to put this is the only free wall i have and if i do that then i don't have cool stuff to put behind me like my awesome sanderson sisters for halloween um which i got from disney they're available on disney's website if anyone wants they're 18 dollars each um it's the best thing i've bought this year i bought winnie in disneyland and then i had to order the other two but yeah my goal is to have like an actual couch I also want to mount gigantic monitors on my wall with my desk so that I have more desk space. James says you're up. You have multiple living rooms? Why? Okay, Mr. Moneybags. I live in New York City. My apartment is gigantic um, for a one bedroom in a pre war building, actually. So. My my apartment is fairly large for a one bedroom. Um but it's also New York City. Thankfully it's rent stabilized, so I pay five hundred dollars less than what it would actually rent out as. So that's that's nice. Um but yeah. Hopefully next year moving to Atlanta. I I already have all the money. It's just a matter of the logistics of the moving part. So hopefully next year I'll be in the Atlanta area with a nice big uh, 
townhouse. That's the goal. A condo. Oh, okay, I got you. It's like a big entry, so you've got like like a sitting like a sitting entry area. It's not really like a living room. The other floor plan is stupid. That's fair. That's fair. Um all I want in my future house is laundry in my unit. A refrigerator that door that has ice and water because that is like in my head these are things that make you rich or like laundry in unit because i've never had that um a dishwasher because i've never even used one in my entire life i've never had one and um a refrigerator that has the ice and the water in the door because i've never had that those are the three things in my head that make you like wealthy like that's the sign of wealth for me because I had friends that had all those things and I never had that growing up. Never had that. I'm gonna be 35 on Sunday and I'm like, never had those things. That's that's wealth to me. So those are the three things I want in my house to be like, I made it. My fridge pours water out the front. Look at that. I'm a classy bitch. That's all I want. Yeah, mm. that sounds good. But yeah, so I'm gonna go, because Mabel is a sleepy. I need to finish my dishes from dinner. Uh, they're in the sink, and I just cleaned the shit out of my kitchen today. So now the fact that I have dishes sitting in the sink is messing me up. So I'm gonna go do that. You're so spoiled. <laughs> yeah, your life is perfect and you're spoiled. Don't complain about anything ever. The 11th, oh my god, we're almost twins. Yeah, my birthday is 1010. Um Libra power. Oh my god, multiple Libras in one place is like dangerous for everyone else. Um, we're a lot, but <laughs> so yeah, I'm gonna go. I'll be back Wednesday, 8 p.m. Eastern. We're gonna pick up where we left off. I'm hoping I'm pretty sure it's saved to like right before this part, so I'm thinking it'll be good. Uh I think we're I think we're fine, but yeah still scared of this game but intrigued enough to want to finish it that's that's the thing because i also love scary movies but i won't sleep for a week after watching them because it's like oh i'm intrigued by it though and then i'm like oh i have nightmares um gbot thank you for that host i'm actually about to sign off but it's good to to hear from you my first day back after a month on off of Twitch, so it's nice to hear from you. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go. But Wednesday, 8 p.m. Eastern, we'll pick up where we left off. I also need to do some research on other scary games that aren't going to send me into a complete panic, like Outlast or something like that, because I just absolutely cannot do shit like that. I'm glad Rin wasn't here to be like, play Outlast, because he does that every time. Um, so yeah, I gotta find some more games that are hopefully a little bit longer, so we can fill up more time and play more scary stuff. Um, I will do the heart rate monitor for everything but Back for Blood, because that game, scary themed, you know, zombies, but it's not, like, actually scary. Um, I did play the beta, I streamed the beta in August, so it's not scary enough heart rate monitor detention i'll definitely wear a heart rate monitor for because i can't even watch the trailer without panicking so that'll be fun um but yeah so that is it for me thank you guys for hanging out um it's been a nice welcome back after a month i'm glad i've, I've gone back and forth on whether or not i wanted to go come back to twitch and i'm glad i did so i'll see you guys hopefully on wednesday and i hope you all have a fabulous evening